I'm an official teenage girl because I have this everything going on, on the top of my head. I've noticed, and this is like really random because I'm really bored, that a lot of girls have this. Like, they do this just because. And I decided to do it because I'm cool. And I do things like that. My hair is amazing. I want to hear about what's going on in my horse life, or you probably don't, because you're like, why the heck is she talking about this? Because that's just weird. People don't just talk about their horse stuff. Well, actually, I know a girl who does, so I'm sorry for saying, um, I say, um, a lot. And it sucks. Uh, anyway, uh, anyway, uh, anyway. So, dog ran into my car. Well, my mom and dad's car. So, I don't drive yet. Huh. This dog freaking books it out of the side of the thing and rams into the side of the car. And does like this bounce thing, which just kind of bounces off the side. Uh, uh, uh. No. No dog. And here's the car. And my mom was like, we even know what. Didn't die though. Which is really good because I felt so bad. I already felt bad that he hit the car, even though it wasn't my fault. And I'm really bored. Oh! And if you didn't already hear, which you probably didn't, Spaz got a horse. <laughs> wow, I need help. She got a horse, yeah. It's amazing. She's a purebred Morgan, four years old. One, two, three, four. Two, four, three, two, one. I'm mean, gonna have to say her name, right? Her name is. Uh, 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 uh. Well, it was Cinnabon, but she changed it to Cricket. Midnight Dawn Ranches, Cinnabon's Brigade. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. There's like this stupid little thing on my hair here. Again, it's bothering me. Uh, <laughs> wow, anyway. It won't let me see anything. Oh, crap. What is, is a picture? There we go. It's a picture of a girl in a wedding dress riding a horse on a beach. That is how I'm gonna get married. It would definitely involve a horse. I can say that. It would definitely involve a horse. Pictures. 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 Um, anyway. Oh, and today I was watching this show and this lady lost her horse. Her horse like died because it starved. Because the stupid people that were supposed to take care of it, they didn't. And they left him out in the field for like all of winter when there's no grass. I almost cried. <laughs> so sad. Okay, I'm sorry. Now I need to address this issue because I was making a really random video and I watched the section where I talked about the gal whose horse died. I mean, come on. Like, literally, these people left this horse out in the field and she told them she was like, you need to take him back in the field during winter because there's no grass out there for him to eat. Whereas in the summer, there's like tons of grass to eat. And she was up in New York in college, so he trusted, she trusted these people to take care of a horse. And what do they do? You leave him out in the field and he freaking starves to death. I mean, come on. And then they don't tell her for like two months. Like, she's out at college in New York, and these people are in Alabama. So it's not like she can drive all the way down there. I mean, she could if she wanted to. But it's not like she can, you know, go there daily to check on the horse. And these people left him out there, and he was so skinny, and like she was concerned, and she's like, "You guys need to defeat him and stuff." And they were like, "And they, I, they, they just didn't do it." I mean, that makes me mad. Does that make you mad? Like, honestly, that is ridiculous. I mean, if someone just in me to take care of their horse, I would make sure that I did whatever they asked. I mean, honestly, it's just stupid. That makes me really mad. That someone would do that. That they would just take the horse and leave it out in the field when there's nothing for it to eat. Poor baby, he freaking starved to death. Anyway, the show that it was on was Miami Inc. And she was getting a tattoo of him. And I was like, and well and then he dies and they don't and then they then she calls like two months after he's died after he's already been dead. The people don't even tell her. And then she calls up and to ask about how he's doing. And they go, oh yeah, by the way, he's dead. I mean, seriously? Like, I don't know, that just really pisses me off. 
I don't know. I would be so ticked off if someone did that to me. Honestly, I'd be like, you need to freaking like get away from me before I punch you in the throat. Yeah, that makes me mad. <laughs> yeah, that's my rant. I just got really mad about that. <laughs> I got really mad, so. Yeah. I have nothing else to do with myself. So, I really want my best friend to Skype me. Because I'm going to Skype. Which reminds me, I should probably do that right now. <gasps> Where'd it go? It's in, not in the documents and applications. That's a big Skype button. I'm gonna click on this because it's gonna go away. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> oh, she's funny. Oh. I'm pretty bomb. Just saying. And for those of you who think that you're not bomb because you're yourself, you need to stop thinking that. Because it's not true. You are bomb just the way you are. Yeah, I'm gonna start like preaching right now and be like, yeah, anyway, I'm just kidding. But it's totally true. Everybody is bomb just the way they are. Or they're, you're missing an arm, you have a little chunky side, a skinny side, which I don't know how you can be unhappy with that. We won't go there. <laughs> and, or if you're a blonde or a brunette, or half and half, or blue haired, red haired, purple haired, green haired, turquoise if that even exists or bright pink I saw a girl with bright pink hair and that was amazing it's my phone it's Samsung oh, watch this oh check it out oh it's a phone it's a phone it's a freaking phone guys so you watch stuff I just amazing this ah, you didn't see you didn't see that that was so awesome and then we go like this and we put oh check it out look it has a secret message you can't read it though because it's freaking backwards it says hello when you put that up it always says hello oh my phone is amazing Let's see what we watch ah, check it out hello i'm the phone i am the phone and i love you I'm a phone. I flip. Okay? I slide open. I slide. I try to. I have so much swagger you can and desire but to do it. So, pfft. Alright, pfft. I don't like it. Pull up. Stupid computer. Computers. You know what, people? Computers are so. so. they have such attitudes. Such mental attitudes. Stupid computers. We're so stupid. So stupid, stupid, stupid. Do you hear pieces? You know what I'm talking about? I'm just kidding. I don't mean to offend any piece of people. Just pieces, 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 pieces. No, I can't talk because, yeah, the computers can suck. And, blah. So, a crazy, you think I'm nuts. But, you know what? I turn my doors and computers still suck at balls. And, 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 I'm amazing, I'm a friend, and I hurt you, the people, because you're amazing, and you're subscribed to Horses for JC and the Adventures of Business, so you're awesome, and, yeah, totally amazing. Say bye, because we have to leave now. Oh really, now you're going to be quiet, when earlier you just did a rant on how you hate computers? Yeah. Later.